Yo, what's up guys? Say watches RTA. I recorded about 32 minutes of Say Watch RTA yesterday and then the whole file got corrupted or somehow out. So I have to redo the whole thing and then I was recording something this morning and it was also corrupted. So ugh. struggles, 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 struggles. So let's actually see if it goes correct this time. Restarting run on my phone. Always keep firing boys. So say watch RTA. I think I was playing two sessions. We got about 24 new response. I can't watch all of them. Some of them are in WeTransfer links and WeTransfer links tend to expire. And I'm sorry, I haven't been checking and getting too much updated with this kind of stuff as of lately, but I'm gonna go over the new response. I also got one submission by myself, which was from a guild, which is a really fun clip. So hope you enjoy and too bad. I already seen all of these clips, so I don't give my new like reaction, like that kind of stuff, but we can still talk about it. It's still fun to watch. There's some really good clips and I hope you enjoy. If you haven't yet, subscribe to the channel, like this video and enjoy. First submission from Banks Asia server going off fast. Can we land the stun? No, we do not. So this is in the category of fun. Most of these replies are fun and I already seen this. You're like, okay, so the threat that assessment, the only threat I actually need to kill is the Tessario. But then wait, is this, is this Tessario legit? Triple revenge, high tank, surviving armor broken hits, and he's just obliving your whole team on fucking revenge and just destroying your team. That's that's legit. That's legit. This is often more often not gonna work than work. But this is fun. This, this is actually fun. Good one, good one. A submission from Chris, Europe server, German flag. We got a cleave. Working with the cleave, but if there's no attack buff, cleaves often do not work as well. So let's actually see. I'm not sure what's all resisted because my German is not that good for reading it that fast. And I'm also not used to summoners war terms in German. I can speak some German, but not in summoners war terms. Ooh, that was so close. That was so close. Okay. Okay, Diana. Can we do Diana things in here? There's gonna be a bunch of Diana clips in here. If if you're asking for fun clips or like stupid shit, nine out of ten you want Diana. Also, that Tiana is doing way too little uh, damage. It is pretty tanky, which is nice. But if you're cleaving with the Tiana, man, you want to do hella damage on that Tiana. The Tiana should have wiped the whole team easily there. Didn't do it, and that's gonna be your downfall. That's definitely gonna be your downfall because can you kill with this? No, I can't. You don't. <laughs> Again, you don't. But yeah, then the shields come up, and then you know where it's going. Then you definitely know where it's going. I think the bomb would have been better on the other unit as well. I think, well, it doesn't matter too much right now. Bomb didn't land in the end, any, or didn't explode in the end. Anyhow, and yeah, you're done. You're done. You're, you're not going to win this anymore. Diana's going to eat that shield for days. No problem. No problem. We, we switch again. We go for the pa-pa-pa. We're done. Good match. Good match. Then a submission from Magu saying, I heard you hate despair stunts, which I really do. I really do hate despair stunts. I hate despair stunts more than Firefox. By the way, Magu, long time Twitch subscriber to my channel, Prime Dropper. So hey, if you haven't yet, go to my Twitch, drop that Prime. Let's see what we get here. So it doesn't look too good as of yet. He didn't want to use the S3, but he does strip or he does stun. The correct target there. He did get a bomb. Mm, let's see what we do. Well, let's see what we do. Okay. I think his uh, the enemy friend should have used. Oh no, ma'am, you're despairing everything. I think he should have used S3. Even if Juno would use his S2, there's not as much cycling um, potential from Juno, and Juno strip is only ninety percent plus resistance checks. Juno is not likely to gonna land that on everyone so i would have actually put like fran s3 up especially if getting despair stunned by everything no despair stuns this time okay no despair stuns that time he's actually landing bombs well there's still the threat from that thing oh there's not oh okay 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 he counters plus despair stun yes great that's that's exactly that's exactly what they do to me enemy junos Okay, look at this next clip. This is a clip of my... So, so look at this next clip. This is a clip that was sent to, by a guildie of mine. And this is just right after the Varum was patch buff thing. 
look look how this Pharaoh goes, man. So he is playing two AOE two AOE heavy debuff units. So how does that work with both Nephis and Rika? How many turns is this Veramos gonna take? Ooh man, I I already seen this clip, but it's stupid, man. It's stupid. Look at the debuffs, man. Look at the debuffs. Look look what's look what's gonna happen. It's one turn. It's two turns. It's three turns. We're not done yet. It's four turns. We're not done yet. It's five turns. We're not done yet. That's six turns. <laughs> and he got cut. And that's that's seven fucking turns for that fucking Veramos. <laughs> Yo, what up? Then a submission from Left Char, and you can see it's already been quite a while since uh, that I didn't look at this <laughs> because the submission was made on the 9th of March, and we're pretty much like close to the end of April. Uh, happens happens well okay in the end we kept checking it anyways so can we share it can we no armor breaks no stunts if it was actually despair so monkey doing some damage are we gonna kill that oh the pushback was resisted on the Rika which is not too great not too great are we gonna kill that monkey? We're not killing the monkey. Okay. That is an option. That is an option. Nice stun though. Nice stun. Lucky stun. Oh, if that monkey was actually stripped, in this case, you would have been able to despair that monkey as well. So even with glancing, you have a high chance of despairing on multi hits. Hmm. You can also just proc with that. Yes, sir. He's going for the monkey right now. Makes all much sense stunning a monkey no he stuns the elena that's so lucky can you stun back you stun water or you stun wind back which is lucky as well okay so is that 15 percent though is that 15 percent hp hmm that it was not 15 percent hp that was not 15 percent hp but do you see there's a recovery on that unit as well watch what the recovery does watch this recovery because you think like i don't have to hit it right I do not have to hit it. There's dots on it. There's a whole bunch of dots. Pay close attention. Pay close attention. I actually missed this the first time I watched it. I was like, why did it heal? And then it didn't go back. But look at that recovery. And he's like, I'm good. Dots. The dots will kill it. The dots will kill it. I don't have to hit it. I just switch. No problem. What does he do? He even goes for the Elena. Ah, he goes for the Elena. And that... Athna survives because of the recovery. Recovery is applied before dots and therefore you survive. And that Helena also survives. Oh man. Greeting for not killing. Greeting for not killing. It's 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 costing. It's costing. Therefore you're killing. And then people were asking, why is Wadarayu OP? Uh, well, what what a unit that doesn't have any form of sustain is able to 1v1 a Triana like this. It's not even like he has his like sure you slapped doesn't matter you still get a turn and you lap again because you're faster but you're not stupid so there was a good submission and then a submission dante baru global surfer uh oh i remember this is a really laggy clip in general try to refrain from sending these laggy clips because we can barely see what's happening here also, this draft is not too good. Look at the Rika going, by the way. One, uh, two, uh, three. And then, did it go four times? Yeah, four times. Not bad, not bad. Five times. Let's go. Really good, really good. But then the issue is still you go like a justice. One, additional turn. Two, you did. So, yeah, a bit too leggy of a clip. But And then a submission from Kitlat, which I think is using something really interesting. He goes double one stars. And he actually has them ruined. And the the opponent, especially in this like tier, people are thinking like he's trolling, he's trolling. So nine out of ten, people are not gonna ban the one stars. But the one stars are actually the setup for this whole team. And if you would have banned one of the one stars, this whole team wouldn't have worked. And now the team actually works. So <laughs> that's highly troll, man. That's highly troll. Sure, they die in one hit, but that that worked out, and that's that's legit. That's legit that it worked. It's not gonna work every time, but that was pretty funny. Ah, uh, yeah, and some of these submissions are like this. 
I, I feel a cramp coming up. Don't worry, I'm not gonna let you do this. Sorry, this doesn't work. Uh, and then we have a submission from Tots one to one. Actually, two submissions. And this guy is going with a fire demon on a cleave, which is actually pretty good. But then Elena actually has a passive that it's reduced damage from water. That's the original passive that's always been on Elena that actually made her like unique-ish. But yeah, if you just if you just if you just go one proc, uh, two procs, two procs maybe, two procs, two procs. Oh man. And then the issue is because of that reduction damage um, from water, this Molong actually has issues. This Molong he gets stunned and he gets. <laughs> oh man. Look look at him trying. Look at him trying, man. Look at him, look at him procking, look at him trying. Well, you needed the additional frog. Oh, that's, uh, that's so close. <laughs> that's so close. So yeah, if you, if you just play ar around long enough with all of these kind of, uh, what's it called, ponies, then you're gonna get clips like these at some point, right? It's, you're gonna get these kind of clips like, oh, you didn't push back, but you proc, so it's fine. You didn't stun. And you didn't push back again, so you actually need to up your Aki. Probably the flare is higher. But whatever, you proc. Never mind, I said nothing. And... <laughs> you go you go the S1 salt and you still proc on the S1 salt. Yo, yo. Good submission. So that's it for the first half. Thanks for watching. Also, second half is going to be in the description the moment it's released. Also, if you haven't yet... Subscribe to the channel and like this video and do all of that other stuff you need to do like call, call your mom bring back home milk I don't know be nice to people. Hey guys. See you in the next one